So I found this bag at Dollar. Tommy's. This is the bag that I take out with him every day. Uh, every time I take him out, and it's so much easier to just take this than to try and gather everything in your pockets. And I, this has just been a lifesaver. So I wanted to show you guys so you guys can make one. So I found this bag at Dollar Store, and it's one of those um, tall thin bags. That's what it said on the label. Uh, they come in multiple different colors, but I thought this one was kind of neutral. So that if Andrew takes them out, he can take them out too. And it's kind of just like, you know, it's just like a side bag, not like a purse. So that's what I was trying to do. And then I got one of those um, containers from the dollar store with a sanitizer in it. Um, this sanitizer didn't come with it, but this is a replacement. And it's obviously too small, so I put a little rubber band. Um, that's just in case I need a rubber band to keep this in, and yeah. <laughs> the, and I also got one of these little clips at the dollar store as well. Now for a girl who's walking her dog, especially at night, I would recommend putting a little pepper spray on there and just hooking it to this and having it on the outside of the bag with your sanitizer. Uh, easy to use. So that's clipped on the outside, and now let's go to the inside. So, number one, Tommy has a little treat bag that I also got from the dollar store. You know he's obsessed with donuts, so I got him this little treat bag. Got all of his stuff in it, and he knows that this is his treat bag, and he can see the treats and all that stuff. It was cute and just cut really small. Kleenex, just case. He gets rid of I get rid of anything like that flashlight with an extension. I usually put this extension on the outside of the bag at night so I can um, have it easy, accessible, basically. Dog bags. Wow, big surprise, but um, <laughs> you need some dog bags. I got these from Target for $7 for 10 of them, so that's pretty good. And then I keep a spare key in there just in case. That way I know um, I have a key in case I forget mine. Not that I ever do, but I have a backup. I put a little, um, this is a little bandana and tied it on the end. So that way it's big enough so that if I just reach into the bag, I can feel this part and know that it's the key. And two, so I don't lose it. And so that it is different from our house key. Um, so I can tell that this is Tommy's bag key. I also keep an extra clip just in case. You never know when one might break. And keep a pop-up dish. So that way if you need water or something on our longer walks. Some paw wipes that are like the wet wipes. And then a paw towel. Just a little towel for his feet. Just for like every day or if he steps in mud. And an extra bandana. Just in case he gets cold or anything. I like to have this. Um, or if it's raining I can put it on his ears. And then he doesn't get so wet. And that is everything that is in Tommy's bag. Tommy also has a go bag or a like trip bag, I guess. And um, it basically has all the same things and has an automatic 
dispenser for his extra bags but it has all that stuff in it too and a matching roll set but it basically has all of this stuff with the exception of it has one actual like sweater just in case or a t-shirt depending on the season but all of that stuff is also in this little black pack that also has a phone going on it and his Harry Potter wand.